Hello everybody. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you the Shear Trace Circuit Tracer. Great product by Ideal. Um, so I am doing a product review on them because they are amazing and they have a lot of great products aside from the Shear Trace uh, strippers, whatnot. I'm sure why or not any electricians use them before. A lot of different functions uh, with this one unit, so it's really good. Let's start with finding a breaker on a circuit. First step, simply turn it on, right? Let's see, okay, so it's beeping, it's flashing, it's working, it's doing its magic. Uh, but it also has a voltage uh, tester on it. So you can see that this outlet, it's 120 volts, and we're on, and it's AC, and we're ready to go. The transmitter is transmitting. So let's take the receiver over to the breakers and see where this circuit is. Simple as that, right? Okay, the higher the tone, the closer we're getting to the breaker. Let's give it a listen. Can you hear that? A little higher. Sounds like that's it. Going down, down, higher, higher. Closer we're getting to the source, you have the higher tones. So that's my breaker right there. So it's on a kitchen GFI, and that's in a garage. So we're finding a problem right there in itself. So handy dandy item for that. Let's move on. So we found our breaker. Great, easy enough, right? So this uh, transmitter works whether it's uh, power's on or power's off. It, uh, it emits a, a pulse, a signal, so that the receiver can pick that up. Now, let's talk about some other uses for this. Let's say you have an open neutral on a circuit. Well, a lot of times it's hard to find. You have to take apart everything uh, on the wall, you know, all the outlets and what have you. But with this, we have different types of attachments. We would just attach on one of the wires, turn on our, our uh, transmitter, and then we just take our receiver to each plug and find that open circuit. And I'm gonna show you that here in a second. But so you have that, uh, and then also, these are interchangeable. This um, alligator clip comes off, put this baby on and then you stick it right in the plug itself right in the outlet Boop. and then you just go around to each one and then you can find your open neutral so um, so in essence you could find anything without the power on so how about coaxial how about cable TV you want to see which one outside because there's ten of them out there and there's one of them in your room you want to find out where that one is so you can hook up to the splitter attach that alligator clip onto it go outside to each one of the cables boom 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 you found it now this receiver also comes with a sensitivity uh, meter. I think there's four or five settings on this. Now, <clears throat> with this, the sensitivity, if you have it really sensitive, you can go along the wires in a wall. Remember, we're sending a signal, so we don't need the power on, but we could find the wires in the wall just by having it very sensitive so it could read through drywall, wood, and everything else. You wouldn't have the sensitivity all the way up uh, with, with the wires like this, uh, just to find wires, because it would read off the other wires. Because when wires are stapled together, uh, that pulse could kind of get mixed up. So one wire, you, you might get a little bit of a pulse off one wire, but it, you know it's still going to be stronger on the other. But when the, it's too sensitive, I mean, it, it's, it's really trying to read everything. So you adjust your sensitivity, and so we have it attached here to our neutral, and then we could find which one of these are the neutral. So let's go ahead and give that a shot right now, shall we? So let's try and find this on each wire. So I've got it clipped on to my neutral. I've got three neutrals. And uh, we're going to figure out which one goes where. But where's my neutral coming from here? So if we've got a bunch of dead outlets, we're trying to find the neutral. Uh, again, we would take this and go to each plug until it stopped beeping. See, it's already picking it up. See the further you get away from it? So it's picking up this pulse, it's a strong pulse, that's why we don't even have to touch the wire for it. So, ah, there it is. I didn't even have to do, go to three of them. So it picks it up really easy. So you can tell by the higher pitch uh, pulse, or higher pitch, uh, so you can tell by the higher pitches on the, the receiver. And again, you can adjust the sensitivity so you could find anything. So uh, open splices, where the plug is, it's bad uh, in the circuit or what have you. But uh, home runs, you need to find which, which circuit's going through the, the, the ceiling, which one are the ones that I want to 
that I want to find. All you have to do is attach this, put it in an outlet. You can go in the attic, use this until you find that pulse if you had all the power off. So there's a lot of different scenarios you could use for this thing. So, I mean, it, it's really cool. And I've never had one, but I've always wanted one. And I want to thank the, the good people at Ideal for supplying me with this. You know, they asked me to do a review of it. You notice on my videos, I don't do reviews um, because it has to be something that, that I use. Otherwise, uh, I kind of look like a phony. So I don't want to do that. But uh, this I will use. So this is awesome. Uh, like I said, I've always wanted one. So, But uh, check the, the description in, and uh, check for the link, what have you, to, to go to Ideal and get you one of these. And um, yeah. I appreciate you guys watching. Um, now, do we know what time it is? I think you do. Oh, yeah, baby. Roberto's. There's so many of them out here in Vegas. It's like the McDonald's of Mexican food. But uh, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and uh, check in the, the description uh, for a link uh, to get yourself one of these uh, amazing circuit tracers. Take care.